Bitcoin futures. Bitcoin futures threatened to break down this week. Here's the lows of the range coming through here. The market's clearly pushed below that level with an increased spread. Now, a breakdown bar generally doesn't close well off its low. So that's an inconsistency with a true breakdown. And volume was below average, although that only represents three and a half trading days with the holiday last week and the shortened trading day on the Wednesday. So if we look inside that bar to gain a better view, here's the daily chart. You can see the four days trading beginning here was last week's trading with the third day only being a half day. Prices gapped up, which wasn't really supported by the market. There was an attempt to consolidate, which is the low volume as price moved back. So this was an attempt to push higher. Supply has been drawn out here. This was, this was the shortened trading day. Price has moved clearly below that level in response, but closed well off its low. On the Friday, volume, however, was above average, and that suggests there is an attempt to support the market off its lows. So if we go back to the weekly chart now, which makes more sense. Now you've seen what happened inside that bar. Here's the lows of the range. Next level comes through there. Markets come back, and tag that level nicely. There should be some modest support within this zone here. The markets come down, just touched the top of it and seen some buying support emerge at that level there. That leaves some chance of a reversal next week. Doesn't mean there will be, but there's some chance. It wasn't a fully supported breakdown bar last week. Any further downside in response would confirm this as a breakdown bar, especially if the market closes below the previous bar's lows and it's a clear breakdown. So the response next week is important. A reversal like this in blue would likely see the market come back up and attempt to test the highs of the range. A further down bar in response would likely see the market attempt to consolidate and recover around the 50,000 level or just on top of it. So pretty important response next week. But buying support did emerge off the lows this week. Just how strong they are and how strong the supply is that's been drawn out. It's going to be a bit of a battle between buyers and sellers. We'll see which one gains the upper hand probably sometime this week.